I know exactly what's about to happen. Yep. Yeah, you like that wall, yeah. You'll be staring at that wall for a long time, bro. This guy out of here. Yep. Everyone all dying. Dead. Die. Woo! Damn. Is that everyone? Hello everyone, welcome back again to some more Hogwarts Legacy where we are back again in the place where people can use magic and are very crazy for some reason, bruv, acting like I don't just see the fact that- <laughs> Bro, what are y'all doing? What if he sticks like this? What? Don't be silly, it'll wear off in a few hours, I think. Oh, what? What? What is it? What? I have an essay I need to finish for bins. Two inches. Merlins, I haven't done mine either. Uh, okay. Don't leave me here. Did you memorize the dates of magical um, Goblin Rebellion? Not yet, no. Where are you going? Can I help that? No, that's not gonna work. I'll take on you tomorrow. Bro, what is going on, fam? It's been a long time since I've been in the castle, and probably for good reason. But, um, what am I doing here? I seem to- Oh, yeah, bro. I'm just ram through these kids. Right, I saw that. Give me that. No, wrong button. Where did it go? There was a flying paper. Where did that flying paper go? I hear it. There it is. Get it! Nice. Okay, so I actually believe I need to head... Is it up or down? I think it's down, actually. I need to go there. Because I need to speak with this guy. Because I believe I have found another moon for you. So that means I'll have nine out of nine. So we're just going to quickly do this. Hello. Greetings. Yes. Demiguys statues. As a matter of fact, I'll have some moons for you. Oh, my, oh, my man, man. Yes. Enough moons. <laughs> yeah. Okay, but is the puzzle going to be the same or is it going to be harder? Alright, okay. Can we, um... Alright. Okay, fair enough. Oh, I don't even get to do anything. Okay. i got to find 13 now? I guess because now that I have... Okay, so I just get the level 2 Alohomora, just like that. I don't get to do any, like, mini game or whatnot. But I obviously now have access to level 2, so I can unlock more doors, which probably may allow me to find more of these statues now. So that part is somewhat done. I now have the level 2. That's kind of the only really thing. Anything else I could do? Acquire all three combat plants. Oh yeah, I, I was gonna say, I've been walking around the castle. I think I've got some unidentified items as well. So we need to head back to our crib anyway. Uh, we need to grab all the plants, use all those plants. We should then just go and be able to do that. And to have absolutely everything else. Let me identify. Okay, damn. Okay, I've got a few things here, actually, to be honest. Yo, bro, let's check our gear, shall we? 66. Wait, level 23. Can I wield that? I can wield that. Cool. Anti-venom decreased damage taken from spiders. Well, I kind of want to stay away from fighting arachnids, if that's fine. Let me move that invisible. Let's... Damn. Well, that's not too bad. It was a hat, wasn't it? Yeah. Let's get this one. 69. Damage reduced with incendio. And I think the rest were all negative, weren't they? But I think I've got the best appearance possible. So now, let us grab me one of them. Grab me some flux weed. And grab me mandrake. Right, I guess I can collect my potion on that maximum. So acquire three combat plants. So if I hold E, what's my combat? So I have the mat. Oh. I. Oh, wait, hang on. I was about to say. 
cabbage. All right, okay. I now have all three combat plans, so I just need to find them simultaneously. Uh, you know what? Yeah, there's probably a bunch of bad guys around here, right? This is this is the evil place once and for all, anyway. Uh, there seems to be quite a bit of commotion going on up here. What's what's happening up here? Oh, hi guys. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right. Well, here. Have that. Um, have that. And that. Does that count? Okay, I think I've done it all. Right, I'm just going to kill this guy. Die. Damn. Yeah. Everybody's dead. Give me your monies. Man only had one coin. Can't carry any more potions. Can I not, like, store a chest or anything? All right, well, we're there. We've done that quest. Now that one's now done. See, look, bro, we're just picking this off. So now we've got to go all the way back to Hogwarts. And we got to go back to the high biology class. Um, hmm. He's not here. That's just locked. Okay, interesting. But wait, can I unlock this one? No, nope, that is also just locked. Interesting. Oh, hello. I have found you. I'm already at my destination. Right, hello. I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful. Yeah. I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. And the lives that it takes from others. Yes. A hundred percent, bruv. I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Okay, I don't know what they are, but yo. Okay. If there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. The students thriving or the plants? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Okay. Let's see you give it a go. Flipendo. You will want to focus with this spell. Okay. It's as mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. I think we'll be knocking more than just people, but we'll find out. Let's... Damn, this is fast. Woo! Flipendo. Nice. Cool. Another spell. If you'd like to practice a bit more, you're welcome to do so here in the greenhouse. Just yeah. Mind the plants, please. Okay, so I guess it's T. Okay, so I've unlocked all of the purple skills now. That is absolutely all of them. Right, let's give this a go. Flipendo. What does this do? It just... It just spins them around, I guess. The knockback jinx, flipendo, accio, cast, capable of dispelling violet shields. Okay. I'm flipping targets upside down. I don't know how that will benefit me instead of like, um, I don't know. Well, I now have all of the purple spells now, so everything. So we're getting close actually to getting all of the spells. I think we just need to learn bombarda and transformation. Okay. Interesting. I could just I could just transform real people into just cutlery. Mad. See, I still have a whole load of like sub things to go, but let's let's go. You know what? Let's go with the bloodline first. This one's kind of interesting because this one might share us more information, but it might be. Uh, I, you know what? I don't even know. But let's let's just go here instead. I'm just. I seem to be just doing odd errands and different side quests. I've got. I've completed two side quests already today, so we're getting there, we're getting there. I like how these lot are just like waiting for me to be Anything here. Anything to do with the dark heart should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything oh. to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the <coughs> risk. I can't Hello. And I'll not say a word more. I'm sorry. Huh? I won't give up. Okay. Well, hello again. About. He's being ridiculous. Apparently, Salazar Slytherin has a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. Yeah, you mentioned that before. Was used for the dark arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. Dark arts are changed. I'm curious about the dark arts. <laughs> the dark <laughs> Why not? Do pique my interest. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Mm. I've spoken out of turn. 
Ominous's family history is personal to him. I assume I assume his family's a bunch of bad guys, but um You know what, yeah, you don't have to tell me. You needn't tell me if you don't want to. If I were you, I'd be begging for more details. Nah, I think we are I think I think we Okay, fair enough. I'm a bit curious then. And you can certainly trust me if you want to tell me anything. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Yeah. Are you familiar with the Cruciatus Curse? The Cruciatus Curse. Um, I'm pretty sure that one is the one that like inflicts pain, or is it the one that puppeteers people? Uh, it's between them two. I think it's the one that just invokes pain on people. I think, I think, what is it? I think Imper Imperius is that the puppet one? You know what? Let's just say, yeah, I am. Okay, yeah, I was right. I was right. It was the pain one. Okay, fair enough. had no qualms about casting us on muggles for sport. Damn. He described the sound of the victim's cries as horrific. So the first time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. Oh, I guess that didn't end well. His family cast it on him. Oh. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to. But he still hasn't forgiven himself. Damn, bro. See, look, bro. His family's a bunch of bad guys. He had no choice. After that incident, the rift between Ominous and his family only grew. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind okay. him of that when I follow up about the scriptorium. Watch okay. me now. I'll have news soon enough. I'll make Ominous understand. He'll change his mind. Okay. So is that is that wait, that that was it? Oh, it wasn't. Oh, it's not. It's just a bit of lore. I just got a whole lot of lore. All right, fair enough. I mean, I, I thought it'd be a bit different. So I guess these, yeah. Actually, the more I look at it, the, the more I look at this, I see that the icon literally looks like a speech bubble. I thought it was like a magnifying glass at first for some reason. But now seeing that and that it wasn't actually a, a quest it was just a, a little bit of lore so we could do this one the lost child that is learned of a wizard who's being harassed we should meet her there to investigate sure why not uh, let's carry on from our adventure from the end of the last episode and we must make our way to where exactly oh we haven't been here we gotta go. We, we looks like we walk in. Why? Why is it telling me to go all the way around the castle? Surely I can just go through this like south bridge, right? Why is it telling me to walk all the way around the castle when I can just go to here? See, the broom is just faster. And B. Woo! Nailed it. I right. oh, I gotta wait. Yep, I'm just on the ground as I am. Let us talk. Is this Mr. Bickle's home? I believe so. He supposedly has evidence against Hallow. We need to speak with him. I, do, I don't know how open he's going to be when uh, children are going to be, you know, around here, you know? Okay, this might actually end up being something we'll have to find. But you know what, yeah. Let me just, let me just, uh, you know, do some goodies check real quick, bro. I just need to just do this out of the way. I'm just out of collecting goodies. Don't mind me. This is all for a very good cause, okay? Very good cause. I can now make a Christmas tree. Unfortunately, we are way too early or way too late. All right, you know what? Let's just speak. Let's speak to this woman. Are you all right? We're looking for Mr. Bickle. My husband is dead. Oh, damn. They killed him. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mrs. Bickle. Who killed your husband? Theophilus Harlow. Oh. I'm sure of it. He's been threatening my husband for weeks and... Oh, where is my son? God damn, bro, this where took a... Is this is taking a... Okay, fair enough then. Uh, I'm, I'm sure your he son is fine. Around here somewhere. When did you last see him? Archie was home with his father while I was out. Uh-oh. Is Satchel's missing? Hopefully he's just gone wandering. As he's prone to do. I hope okay. he was here when Harlow... When my husband... God damn, bro. Okay. Which way Archie might have gone? Um, he has a 
There's a little hideout in the forest south of here. And you didn't bother to check. But if he witnessed Harlow doing something to his father. I, oh, he would probably would I'm have intervened. To leave in case he comes back home. Bro, why am I smiling, by the way? Hang on a minute. What is this? Yeah, bro, change your expression. Yeah, let's go find it. Come on, fam. Find your son, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. <laughs> what am I going to do? Uh, I'm pretty sure the husband is probably the dude we're looking for because he has the evidence, and now, conveniently, he's dead. Okay. Okay, well, this one is actually, like, is... Uh, Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. There you go. Okay. Yeah, but it seems like the bad guys know. You know, the fact that we probably robbed all those animals as well, he probably thought that it was him. Uh-oh. What are we being attacked by? You know what? Yeah, just run. <laughs> I don't know, it doesn't matter. What did Officer Singer say about the letter you brought her? Oh. She thanked me, but she clearly felt that it was not enough. Okay. It is a shame that hippogriffs cannot speak. Your friend Highwing could provide all the evidence against Hallow that we need. Yeah, there, there might be like a way to... There might be a way to speak to animals, I don't know. This must be little Archie's hideout that Mrs. Bickle mentioned. Oh, there's a load of children's toys everywhere. Archie Bickle! I think he is going. Huh. Okay. Oh. Okay. Wait, you figured that out from what? How? Bro, oh, you don't need Revelio to see freaking footmarks down here. Yeah, man. We find a dead child. Damn. I don't know what. What do we do? But hey, yo. We'll be fine. Oh, are we still following the trail? I can't actually see. I can only see the footprints if they're close by, so. Let's see if we try and speed them up. Oh, okay. No, no, no. It's fine, bro. We got this. Easy. Yeah, all of y'all getting work. Hang on. Let me flip a wolf. Launch an enemy into another enemy with the pulsar. Okay. Boom. Damn. Hit him with the double kill. Oh, you're still fighting. Oh, I thought we were done. Damn. I actually got a bit there. Woo. Whoa. Damn. You know what, bro? Burn. Yeah, I think we're done now. I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure we would see dead children remains, you know, if he got eaten by the wolves. As far as I'm concerned, I think he's fine. This is interesting. Why would he leave it behind? He was likely running from Hollow, distracted. This may be a good time for Revelio again. Yeah. Uh, okay, I see something. Uh, where do I go from here, though? You... Luckily, this woman's just leading the way, I guess. Or, or maybe not. Where's this way? Okay. Yo, 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 let me get this. Let me get this. Way. You ain't gonna cast us? Oh. We'll be fine. I'm sure this child is very crafty. He'll get out of this. We got high hopes, right? Um. The hell is that? Huh. They are beautiful, are they not? Can I take one? I witnessed death when I was nine. So oh. Okay. Yeah, that's what I thought. I thought they were the ones where you have to see death in order to see it. What death did I see? Can I suck it? Yo, let me suck you, fam. Come back. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yes. Yes. I got myself some anorexic dragon. Let's go. Magic beast. Cool. Make a fine addition to my collection. Yes, let us let us not, like, you know, get distracted by the past. Because as far as I'm concerned, uh, it ain't gonna change. So, there is a bunch of bad guys over there. You know what that means? What's good? Whoa, damn. Hey. Oh, hang on. Damn. I don't know what I'm doing, but... Yo. Oh, wait, this geezer's level 27. 
damn. Oh, he's dead anyway. Boy. Hang on. Damn. There we go. Damn, right. Get in the floor. Right, flip the geezer. Oh, oh, ass. There we go. Yo, get flipped. There we go. Damn. Levitator. Alright, okay, I got you. Uh, Expulso. Who... You can cast Expulso fast. Oh, I'm actually dead already. Um... It's geezer heal, isn't it? There we go. Alright, okay. You know what? Yeah, let's just kill these geezers. Right, you know what? This geezer's just gonna run away. Nope. Dead. Anyone else? Are we done? Right. Enter the tent. Let's go. Oh, I'm just... Yep, enter the tent. I did not expect this tent to be so large on the inside. That complicates things a little. Bro, I didn't realize I entered a freaking TARDIS. Jesus Christ. Magic, man. Magic. You can get away with anything. You know what? Yeah. Sneaky vibes? Oh, I know exactly what's about to happen. Yep. Yeah, you like that wall? Yeah. You'll be staring at that wall for a long time, bro. This guy out of here. Yep. Everyone all dying. Dead. Die. Woo! Damn. Is that everyone? Okay, this child is annoying me now. Where is this? Where is this geezer at, fam? Oh, hello. That is a rusty ass cage. How do you know who I am? Your mother sent us to find you. Oh, I'm so glad to see you. Hello. That's fine. We killed a load of geezers. Can we not just Alohomora? There we go. Finally. Slim simplicity. Right. Um, there it is. Nice. Nice. I'm Uncle Tarlo. He killed my father. We're so yeah. sorry, Archie. We won't let him get away with it. But first, we need to get you home to your mother. Thank you. I swear to God, if I have to you escort this child away, all the way back, man. Let's get you home. We know a safe way back. Okay, no, it's just teleporting me out of it. There we go. Although I didn't fully explore that place, there's probably some more loot in there. That's a tad bit annoying. <laughs> oh, look, I can, I can target lock with caps lock. Hmm. So to keep me enemy, so instead if I'm... Uh, group. Hmm, interesting. I actually did not know that. Okay, so we're literally just back at the village. Mad. Well, there we go. We found your kid. Hi. Your husband's friends may be in danger, just as yeah. he was. How can we help? You've done enough. My husband was a powerful wizard and couldn't defeat Harlow. Well, the last thing yeah. Is that monster coming after you. Well, these have to be anyway. Like, uh, as far as I'm concerned, I'm like the number. I'm the number one enemy here. So, you know, I could I could just be boldly and just go, yeah, he's already after Maybe us, fam. Too late for that. I'm afraid Harlow's already after us. Yeah. But you needn't anger him further. <laughs> I assure you, the threat could be a lot worse. Alright. Please, please keep your distance. I'm sorry again about your husband, Mrs. Bickle. Thank you. And thank you for bringing Archie home. I can never repay the two of you for your kindness. Oh. Alright, okay. Don't worry, Mrs. Bickle. My father used to say that rain does not fall on one roof alone. We are here to help each other. All right. So what happens now? I must learn more about Mr. Oh. Michael's friends and why Harlow is after them. You'll be hearing from okay. me as soon as I know something. Thank you for your help today. All right. Cool. Fair enough. No problem. Right. I see a couple chests what here. What do we have here? A demi Wait. A demi guys. Is that what you said? Where? Oh, bro, there's a whole, there's a whole herd of geezers. Can I get in? Oh, I can get in. Yeah, let's break that. Yeah. Search the bag, scarf. Where's, where's the demi guys? It's in here, isn't it? Okay. I'll, I'll take that money. There we go. Search. Unidentified face item. Oh, the demi guys is right there. Okay, right. If I press F and then. Do do do. Yes, advance the time. The power. Yep. Oh. My efforts were in vain. 
Meet me outside the Slytherin common room. We need to talk. Okay, bro, I just changed time. My guy's immediately doing that. But yo, fam, I got another move. Thank you again for finding my dear Archie. Oh, yeah. Thank you again for saving me. I'll never forget you. Yeah, just don't question why I'm in your house. That's absolutely fine. Are you a trader, fam? Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Singh. Hello. And this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. You sound very similar to a certain other bloody trader that we know. Hang on a minute, fam. Yo, bro, how do they run out of voice actors, fam? Don't think I don't know that. Right. May I see your wares? Let's see what you got. Okay, you just sell me just random crap. Fair enough, then. Um, well, I guess maybe you could take some of my old ass armor. Yeah, you can take it all, actually, to be honest. Because as far as I'm concerned, yeah, no, this is all useless to me. All right, I got a couple of unidentified items. Um, let us go back. Hope to see you again sometime. I hope to see you again sometime too. Right, let us make our way back to our room of requirement, I guess. All right. Yes, I'll take more, more things. Okay, so the goggles are useless, but the I got a new, I got a new cloak. Level twenty six. What? Seventy one from fifty seven, bro. 20% more damage. Damn. Level 26, though, for that one. That is... That is mad. So we got to speak with the house elf. we got to find more of them moons now. Uh, we got to speak to some woman in the thing. And then we go back to my guy, who is in just outside the common room. We're back on the path. Interesting. Okay, so this is what we're going to do uh, next episode, because I'm going to end this here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. And until we're graced with a chance to meet again, don't forget to like subscribe and hit that bell and until the next time where i guess we just gotta do more of the quest this one's kind of like another errand mission i can't lie but hey uh, we completed a couple side quests we've got more knowledge about the main story and is a possibility that those ones with the speech bubble with the um, characters who are entwined with our main quests is a possibility that we'll have to do those little dialogue quest thingies anyway before we proceed forward so it just makes sense to do it that way and get them all out of the way first before we do the big thing, which we'll do in the future. So until then. <laughs>